School was always a, a wonderful place for me. I came home from school in second grade and told my mother I was going to be a teacher. And I became a teacher and started teaching at the age of 21 and I'm still teaching because it's an awesome profession. One of the things I look forward to the most every day is the first question of the day because I could never predict what that question will be and it often sets the tone for uh, a discussion and it's, it can be very exciting. We don't have a curriculum that says we have to be on a certain page on a certain day. We all seem to have a common goal and that's to learn. If we see that our class needs to go in a certain direction, we can, we can go into that direction. We can follow the child. What I really would like to help instill in students is an awe for the universe and the world in which they live. As future leaders, they're going to need to be problem solvers. I want them to realize that when they see a problem, that there are ways to channel their energy and come up with solutions and work towards positive change in the world. I want to help them in their writing give voice to their humanity, to be able to put themselves on paper. We're giving them so many tools for life. How to think, how to be patient with themselves, how to accept the fact that they're going to make a mistake and that's okay because we all make mistakes. Everything we do in the classroom has a direct connection to the outside world. No matter how tired I am, and there are days we're all tired, I'll come in here, and once those kids come in, they energize me. I am energized, and anybody walking by my classroom, I tell the kids sometimes they probably wonder what's going on because I'm, my hands are going all over the place, and I'm animated, and they are. And so exciting to see a child who rises to the occasion and we, we see that every day. It's a great feeling. <laughs>